now. Well, moving along to our trending segment of the day, let's check in with Joel Rogers, who's in the Content Center. And Joel, you have a video that shows that guitar playing really does soothe the soul. It sure does, Dan. Good morning, everyone. Today's next trending video, it is a medical first. It features a patient, get this, playing the guitar while undergoing brain surgery. Something to see, and here it is. All right, the man you see here is Brad Carter, 39-year-old actor and musician. He was diagnosed with Parkinson's disease. The disease causes his eyes to tweak and his hands to tremor, rendering him unable to play music or act, you know, both of which he loves more than anything in the world. And in a medical first, the patient Brad Carter, seen here, is playing the guitar while undergoing brain surgery. Now the aim was to help the surgeons pinpoint exactly where to place the electrodes to treat the effects of his Parkinson's disease. Now doctors say the surgery will not cure Mr. Carter's disease, but it will help control his tremor so he can, so he can continue to rock on. If you'd like to take a further look at this, you can take a look at it at architectshomepage.com. We've also posted it on our Facebook page, facebook.com slash NBC6news. Now, Dan, uh, Bill Gates said never before in history has innovation offered promise of so much to so many in such a short amount of time. Mm -hmm. And seeing this video here just goes to prove it. Oh, absolutely, Joe. I couldn't agree more. The advances in technology in the last 10 years are astronomical. I don't know how else to say it. I mean, the previous 100 years don't equate to what's taken place in the last 10, and that is a great example of it. Unbelievable. Right. When I was watching this video yesterday, I could not believe what I was, what I was watching. This man is playing guitar while undergoing brain surgery. It is, it is amazing. Truly. Yeah, well, if you want to see more of Joel's videos, again, he posts all of those on our website, arclitexhomepage.com. Joel, thanks so much for that report this morning. We really appreciate it. Well, coming up, we are going to...